Welcome to our online lesson on time requests. Time request is a module in time control that allows us to make a request for approval for a time that will happen in the future. Uh, here I've logged in as Gail. Uh, Gail has uh, no current time requests. Uh, she's in the time request list and she can go and add a time request by clicking on add. Uh, she might want to ask for some vacation time and she can put in a description of that time. Uh, she can add time only for herself. Uh, an administrator might be able to add time for someone else. The start date of this we'll say uh, is going to happen uh, a few days from now and it's going to go on for uh, five days. Uh, and then what would we like to charge that time against? Well we have a, a whole range of possible choices. In this case we'll take vacation time and the default rate for Gale which is going to be her standard rate. We could have chosen banked time. And how many hours per day would we like? Um, taking last week of this year's vacation. And we'll click on OK. Uh, this now becomes a detailed time request with five days listed. We can actually see the detailed line uh, as, we, uh, as we update the list. And we can take a look at Gail's. Uh, we can take a look at Gail's list now. So we have these five lines that we've created. We can actually edit any of these lines. Perhaps on the last day, she might need to take uh, four hours, or she would like to change one of those days. But once she's sure that this is the request that she wants to make, you can see that status is draft. She's going to release that for approval. Where it's going to go is the same place her timesheet would go for approval. In this case, to her supervisor Tom Logan. So the status of this is it's currently waiting for Tom to approve it. And we'll just log out of time control now and go back in as Tom Logan so that we can see how the approval for this would go. Uh, once we go into the, uh, the last level of approval, uh, then this will become an approved uh, time request. So we'll take a look at the time requests. We've gone into timesheets here. There we go. We have one time request which is waiting approval. And Tom can highlight that. He can release it. He can reject it. In this case, we'll say that has been released. And because Tom is the last person in that uh, release structure, this is now approved for Gail. What this means is that when Gail enters her timesheet for that week, Time Control will automatically insert these approved lines. Uh, this would happen even if her timesheet was automatically created during the autofill pr procedure that an administrator could do. So. Requesting vacation, easily done now with time request. Uh, but you could also request other kinds of time. Perhaps uh, time off for personal time, or travel time, or time to be in a different kind of location or different office. Even requests for overtime or for other types of categories of time that you may wish to approve for time. The key for time request is that it's approval for time in the future. And once approved, it will automatically appear in that person's timesheet. Thanks for spending time with us. Take a look at some of our other time control lessons.